What I'm looking for being on The Bachelor is uh, possibly just finding someone just to hang out with. I like to meet new people and just like to hang out. You know, I might just find that lucky one. My name's Shelby Parento. I'm 22 from the Eastern Shore of Maryland. Um, I'm a history major. I'm involved with the History Club, Philosophy Club, APO. That's about it. I'm Shannon Savoya. I'm 21 years old and I'm from Central New Jersey. I'm in a business administration major minoring in sociology and economics. I'm currently an intern at Schiff & Associates, which is located in Towson, Maryland. I am also a volunteer for VITA. It's Volunteer Income Tax Assistance and it's an IRS program that McDaniel hosts. Some of my hobbies, um, I'm a classical pianist. For 10 years I have been and I love to play softball even though I don't play for McDaniel. I'm Caitlin. Um, I am a junior, about to be a senior in a month. Um, I'm from Rhode Island. I am a communication major with writing and journalism minors. Um, I am a student ambassador for the school. I'm also involved with the Free Press. I'm the web editor and I'm about to take over editor-in-chief position. Um, and in my free time, I just like shopping and hanging out with friends. Uh, I signed up to be on The Bachelor because I'm just trying to find that one, you know? I'm looking for a guy who I can have lots of fun with and who will go on adventures with me. I signed up to be on The Bachelor because my great friend Jamal um, asked me if I wanted to sign up and I said what the hell, what are the chances I'll actually be picked to do this um, and I was so here I am now. Um, so I decided to be on The Bachelor because I thought it would be really fun to be on TV and um, it just seemed like a good idea. <laughs> as far as past relationships are concerned. Um, I'm someone who kind of needs to be in a relationship. I'm not really good at being single, but um, I've had a few long-term relationships. One, my last one was long distance, and that kind of worked out horribly um, for about two years. Um, I broke up with my last boyfriend sophomore year because I couldn't handle the distance and it didn't work out, so. <laughs> um, past relationships have generally been foreign. Um, they had a guy from England and one from Hungary. So I'm looking for a nice American man. What I'm looking for in a guy is someone who's smart, someone who knows what they want, um, someone who can make me laugh, and someone who looks good in a suit. <laughs> My favorite physical feature on a guy is his smile. It's definitely the eyes. Um, his height. And he has to be slim. Uh, I love guys who are athletic, so they have to have a nice build to them too. My perfect date um, I'm not too picky, so whatever the guy would plan, obviously dinner because I like to eat. Um, and then besides that, maybe um, a baseball game or just doing something fun and um, adventurous since I have the attention span of a three-year-old. Something totally unexpected. I don't like asking a guy to take me somewhere. Um, I want the guy to plan out the whole night for me, so dinner. Um, I'm not really a movies type person. Um, I like cuddling. I like going to sporting events. Ice hockey, um, that's the best place, I think, to take me on a date. Probably going for just, you know, a casual walk down Main Street, like holding hands. We go into some of the shops and then have a nice dinner and maybe come back and I don't know, just hang out, gaze at the stars, that kind of thing. Um, turn offs are guys chewing with their mouths open. <laughs> Not keeping in contact with me. If I have to constantly keep in contact with you, uh, forget about it. I don't like that at all. Definitely just having no direction and what you want to do and um, having no sense of humor. A good relationship is around trust, uh, trusting the other person and also supporting the other person in everything that they do. Trust. Uh, I need to be able to trust you and you need to be able to trust me the same way. Um, we need to have the same 
likes and dislikes. I mean, we can work around things, but uh, that's about it. Sex and communication. Communication while having sex. But communication and also sex. <laughs> My spirit animal would be anything. You know, I don't like cats, I'm a dog person. But anything like a cheetah, uh, well, I don't know, like a leopard. I love, the, I love animal print. I have animal print all in my room, in gardens, um, bedspread, everything. So anything related to that. A goose. I went on my spirit quest, and the goose led me on my journey. My spirit animal would probably be a panther, just because I really like panthers. And if I was an animal, I would want to be a panther. <laughs> Favorite dance move? Kind of goes a little something like this. But this is it. Probably the shopping cart. You know, you gotta drive along, check the label, put it in the cart. <laughs> Favorite pickup line is, what's it, how's it go? <laughs> Favorite pickup line, uh, I would have to say it would be, uh, is that a mirror in your pocket? Cause I can see me in your pants kind of thing. Oh, do you know how much a polar bear weighs? <laughs> Enough to break the ice. <laughs> I don't really have one. I kind of appreciate the corny ones just because they make me laugh. Um, but really, just talking to me is a good enough pickup pick line for me. My uh, favorite celebrity crush, unfortunately, he passed away, but Heath Ledger. I loved him to death. And Orlando Bloom would have to be my other one. Uh, several in this category, but I would say uh, Chase Crawford, Gossip Girl. James McAvoy, what a lad. <laughs> One item I can't live without, um, besides my phone, would probably be um, what am I say? Uh, coffee. <laughs> my magic wand. This is kind of embarrassing, but I'm addicted to chapstick. And I have to have one in multiple locations. Always have one in my Vera Bradley wallet that I carry around with me. Always have one in my desk in my car. Uh, it's a problem, but Irrelevant. <laughs> I need to be with my chapstick at all times. On Bachelor, I'm just looking to find someone who is funny and someone who um, can maintain my interest. Um, just a guy I can be compatible with and um, just kind of broaden my friendship base with McDaniel and just um, relationships always lead to new opportunities and new people. I'm looking to find love on The Bachelor, what else? I want McDaniel to know that I am the best bachelorette out there. Um, I may be shy at first, I typically am, but once you get to know me, I'm a very cool person and you'll want to be my friend. Basically, I'm lots of fun and really low maintenance and down for adventure. Okay. <laughs> I'd like the canvas to know that my name is Shelby and I have great tits. If you know me in the classroom, I'm a completely different person out of the classroom and you'll probably see that on Friday or Saturday nights.